the story you only see on Fox 5, cracking down on retail crime. D.C. police taking a proactive approach to a problem plaguing the district. Fox 5's Homa Bash live in Northwest tonight to explain. Homa? Hey, Marina, you know, we've all walked into these CVS and Target stores around the district and seen more and more essential items locked up. Things like detergent, toothpaste, makeup, deodorant. And more and more, it seems like things are behind lock and key than they are out and about. And that is getting really frustrating for workers and customers. Like the entire pharmaceutical health and beauty section is locked up. And uh, so it is. It's inconvenient. You know, it's one of those sayings, you know, this is why we can't have nice things. Well, now D.C. police say they're trying to do something about that rise in retail thefts. Investigators tell me they've teamed up with stores across the district to catch criminals in the act. And in the last few months, they've made dozens of arrests, many of them repeat offenders. These are photos of some of the things that were stolen. Snacks, toothbrushes, shampoos. A lot of these stolen items are then resold on street corners. Now, back in February, we told you about that CVS store in Columbia Heights shutting its doors, citing retail thefts. Video showing aisles and aisles of empty shelves after shopping. Shoplifters ransack the place over and over again. Closures like that hurt the community. People can't get hygiene products or medications as close as they could. Colin Hall is the first district commander for D.C. police. He tells me he hopes this crackdown sends a strong message. We reduce the, the thefts in these places where it's really deterrent that they don't, people don't think they can just come in and steal things off the shelves and walk out and there's going to be no repercussions. So they'll be doing these undercover operations every week throughout the district. When I asked Commander Hall what he'd say to people living in the district who feel there may be more serious crimes to focus on, he says they can do both. They are doing both, and these thefts, these are serious crimes in their eyes. So this is just one piece of the puzzle. And like I was saying, we do apprehend people that have firearms. So doing this, we're able to connect with other crimes, people that are wanted for robberies. This and they're taking these people off the street. Just in the last month, the D.C. U.S. Attorney's Office has indicted seven people for thefts related to CVS stores. They range in age from 26 to 64 years old. Guys. That brings us to our Fox 5 Live Incible question. Will undercover patrols help crack down on retail theft? So far, uh, you can see here 86% of you believe that, yes, that's what it's going to take. Scan that QR code. Head to fox5dc.com slash instapol.